Hi, Jim Chapman on American Air Gun Hunter. I'm in South Africa for the next couple weeks, and right now I've got the Adaman M2 30 caliber, and I'm going out after Rock Dossi, Rock Hyrex. They live up in these uh, cliffs behind me. Also, down in some of the flatter areas, they've spread down there, and they're spreading into the pasture pasture land. So I'm going to take the uh, the M2. I'm going to uh, go set up in uh, the shade of a tree, tuck myself in, put on a face mask, uh, cover my arms up. Maybe take my uh, my camo um, poncho and spread it out in front of me, make a little bit of a blind. These things are really jumpy, really, uh, uh, it's what happens when you're towards the bottom of the food chain. They get eaten a lot, so they're, they're on the move. There's a lot of land out here, but the Dossie are moving out of the cliffs and into the grazing lands. We passed through these warrens and moved up into the cliffs. We saw our first Dossi almost immediately. I tucked in under a thorn tree and eventually they started coming back out. At 65 yards, I put the crosshairs on the top of the Dossi's head and squeezed the trigger. As the pellet impacted, I saw him fold and roll down the side of the rock. The hike up to retrieve my Dossi gives an idea of the distance. I think the 30 retains energy and carries well in the face of a light wind. Shooting at an upward angle and at distance made my rangefinder indispensable. So after a couple hours tucked in down in the shade of trees at the base of these cliffs, I was able to uh, to line up and use this 30 to good effect. I uh, I took a couple of dossi, uh, put them in the bag, and I think I'm going to call it uh, quits for the day. That's enough uh, for one day. But the gun was a uh, tack driver. Shots out to 50, 60 yards. Actually, the the longer the headshot was at uh, at 75 yards, he was up on top of a rock. The Adamant M230 has a lot going for it. I mean, the caliber is a great caliber, uh, and I've really been coming around to the 30 as kind of a standard uh, for a, a small, medium game uh, crossover caliber. Um, and uh, this gun, you see, took out the smaller game very well, but I'm also going to use it on some bigger stuff, some antelope later, so we'll, we'll get an idea of how it works with them as well. The uh, Adaman M2, this, uh, this gun uh, does everything I want in a hunting gun. I really like it. I've been enjoying shooting it so far and still got um, uh, just close to a couple more weeks to go, so we'll see what we get with it.